Goblin Gang. How's it going, y'all? Oh, that died. There we go. How's it going, y'all? We are... What the fuck is going on? There. How's it going, y'all? We're back at it again with another farm run. I uh, hope everyone's doing... I don't have any fucking things. Oops. Hope everyone's doing well. We are... Uh, living the dream. Do I have enter? Do it still. There we go. Oh my god, I'm getting fucked up already. This is a, an auspicious start to the new year, I think. Um, this is wild. Uh, four, five. Come on, just get one more fucker. All right. So, doing another. Uh, oh, god damn it! What is going on? Okay, doing another. Uh, trying to do. Winter tote and some sick, oops, some sick ass farm run action while I do this together. We'll see how it goes. I imagine it's not gonna go great. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys are doing great. Uh, what's new and exciting in the world of the Goblin Crew? Um, I just spent this last week learning how to do fucking Vorkath all over again. That was fun. It was not fun. It took me so long to fucking figure it out. I don't know why it was so hard for me to do it, but I did manage to learn how to Wooks walk properly, which was exciting. I got like 40 kills. I got like 30 kills. And I made like five mil, so I'm up to 200 career Vorkath kills, which is not too shabby if you ask me. So that was fun. I, I, I ugh, excuse me. I enjoy uh, PVM a lot um, in this game. I mean, I, I'm excited that I'm actually like sort of in the realm of being able to do it for like realsies like i can actually contribute to like raids and stuff and my gear's getting good and all that so hopefully i'll be able to have like interesting content i don't know it, it, it'll be cool to do like i'm excited to do like the corrupted gauntlet because uh i had gotten like not too bad at that during uh leagues and during uh just like People seem to like watching me stream doing some gauntlet runs, so hopefully I can do that and do it well. Um, but yeah, it's, we're 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 gaming. We're getting up the the uh, getting 95 Slayer for Hydra is gonna suck, but it shouldn't be too terrible. I don't think. What? Do, oh, I need this dragon fruit. Fuck. Dragon fruit. Uh, regular tree. There you go. So, yeah, we'll, uh, I'll let you know how that goes. I mean, that's gonna be Groot, 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 you know, by then, who knows where I'll be. So I'm still trying to find a balance of do, how to do like good farm runs, um, like farm runs with content and actually like doing uh, some farm runs for XP. Why is my mini map off? Jeez. Sorry. I, uh... Tried to get a shot for... Um... For, uh... I, I got a shot for a thumbnail. The most recent Growing for Groot thumbnail that you saw. Not this one, but... And I have to, like, turn off all my rune light settings to do that, and it's just, like... It's not hard, it's just annoying, because I always forget to turn them back on. 
So it's always like, <laughs> I'm always like, what am I doing? Where's all my stuff? I don't know. So, um, I guess now's as good a time as any to talk about it. I, I wasn't like, I'm not trying to necessarily like dwell on it, but it is kind of going to be an important part of my life for the next month. Um, I'm losing my job. <laughs> so remember how I was like fucking real excited about uh, getting everything under control and like figuring out how to do. Uh, I was like, yeah, I finally I'm all figured out on how to manage my time properly and do my job and everything. Well, yeah, no, I'm gonna have to figure that shit out again. So the um, like recruitment agency I work for, they're like a consulting firm, I guess. Um, they like hire, it's like a talent agency, right? Like they hire people out and say like, okay, you go here or whatever. So they, uh, my boss with the company I work for was like, yeah, we, um, turns out we don't need, uh, motion graphics. So we're going to end the contract like eight months early. So, you know, it is what it is. It sucks. But, um... It's just accelerated whatever I was supposed to be doing before. You know what I mean? Like, uh, it, not, the only thing that's changed is that I have to look for work now instead of in seven months. Which is, you know, not great. I was hoping to not have to worry about this until after my wedding. <laughs> I was really kind of hoping to get through that without much problems. But I am okay with this. I am not thrilled. Like, I don't want it to seem like, oh, like, the job I had was nice. It turns out I really like working um, at home. I know I've said this many, many times in the last couple months, but, uh, yeah, working from home is great. So hopefully my, the agency can, like, find me a new uh, remote job. But this gives me time to, like, do stuff that I need to do anyway, like fix up my like demo reel and stuff like that. Like something that I haven't done in a couple years, which is like, it's important to keep on that shit. So this I think is finally just gonna like force me to actually do it, which like is good. So it's not great. I don't like doing it, but I haven't done it in a couple years. So I guess this is, you know, now an appropriate time more than ever. Uh, it is annoying. I'm working, so I'm working on that. I'm working on my like animation reel. Fuck. Um, I'm working on my website. That's cool, right? Like I'm building a website to showcase sort of like all of my stuff that I've been working on. Like, cause I do more than just like video edit and animation, not a lot. You know, I've got like, I want to have a spot for like my writing and my, if I do like voiceovers and stuff like that. And if I do like, just like all my different stuff, right? Like it's important to have all that in one spot so I can just point people to that website and be like, here, this is, this is me. This is what I do. Please hire me. Please give me lots of money. But the worst part about this, and I think it always, I think the reason why I don't like going over my old work is that I'm never like, I'm never satisfied with it at the, like looking back on it, right? Like I definitely, and like this is imposter syndrome is like real, right? Like that's just how shit is in the world we live in, especially in like a gig economy, I feel like. But that's a whole, that's a whole situation for another, another day, right? Talking about the, the sh fucking terrible economic world we live in. I'm never like, thrilled with the stuff that I put out. I don't know. It's a mix between like, I just need to get it done because it's work and it's not like my passion projects and stuff like that. But also like the stuff, when I take the time to actually do the stuff that I want to do is like, that's when I like learn the most, right? So like I look back on it, it's like, oh, that's not very good anymore, right? So I don't know. I, um, my, it is a necessary part of making art, I think in any regard is like, self-reflection and stuff like that and like self-acceptance so i don't know this is part of my resolution was to be kinder to myself right so i guess we'll take it as it comes and uh <laughs> sort it out you know it's now's the time to do it i guess is just sort of we'll go through and we'll make sure that everything looks nice and nice pet dog but my goal this year i really want to work on my like 3d portfolio 
and stuff like that. My animation, my graphic design, like I, I, I want to get, I want to expand more into that because I feel like there's more opportunities. Um, I feel like that I can command more uh, money. I can make more money, in all honesty. And like, you know, I enjoy doing it. It's fine. I like editing. I like video production, but um, it doesn't. There's not a lot of money in it, unfortunately. And I, you know. Like, I don't even know why I chose this field. This is the other thing, too, is, like, right? Like, me reflecting on my journey and where I am just makes me fucking get upset at myself for not taking college as seriously as maybe I should have. And... But, like, I didn't know what I wanted to do. And I still don't, right? Like, I'm still not... I don't know. I, I like, I didn't... I didn't know that this was an option for me, right? Like, I didn't... I didn't... No one told me in high school or anything or growing up that like, oh yeah, you can do like graphic design. Like that's a thing you can do. Oh, you like to draw? Well, if you don't want to be a fucking concept artist for like a video game or if you don't think you're good enough for that, like what if you did stuff for magazines? And it's like, oh yeah, like, yeah, it turns out that shit's really fucking cool and fun. I, uh, I didn't go to school for that. So now I've, I'm super far behind everyone else that has, you know, I tried to apply for a job that like, I'm very much qualified for. <laughs> um, and it was like, how many years of graphic design experience do you have? And it's like, well, professionally, like six, because like I've done graphic design throughout the years. I'm not a traditional trained school graphic designer. I haven't worked in like an agency or anything like that, but like I've done work. I, I know how, to, I know my way around Photoshop and Illustrator. like. It's, you know, it's definitely maybe not my strongest suit, but I'm, I'm good at animation. I'm good at uh, motion graphics. That's graphic design. It's just a different type. And it was like, the qualification was like, oh yeah, well, you need seven years of experience. And I was like, come on. And it fucking kicked me out of the application. I was like, okay, whatever, that's fine. I didn't want to work at your stupid company anyway. But I, I need, so like, and like, here's the problem now, right? Like I'm getting far enough in my life that like, I can't take entry level jobs anymore. I can't be working for fucking $10 an hour or $15 an hour. I've been working for like a, a decade. <laughs> I, like I should be, I should be making more money now. Like it's not, I don't know. When I told, when I got this job, my current job, they were like, how much, how much money were you making at your last one? And I was like, uh, like $15, but like I'm getting grossly underpaid. And they're like, yeah, that seems like not good. I don't regret going into the arts because I wouldn't, I can't do anything else. I mean, shit, I can barely work in an, like in a building that's not my own house. I don't know, man. Getting cut from anything. <laughs> Being told that you're not needed anymore is always a hard experience and I'm sure everyone can relate to that, but I will carry on as best I can and use this as motivation to improve, I guess, right? Like. I, like, I want to work at a job. I want to do a job well, and I want people to recognize that, oh, I've done this job, I'm worth my salt, or whatever. You know what I mean? My, I don't want to have to go back and keep... Not that I don't want to keep improving and stuff, but, like, I don't want to have to keep fucking being like, okay, well, that job ended, now it's time for me to, like, reassess my skill set. <laughs> what else and like what else can I learn to add to this skill set to make me fucking a valuable commodity? It's like I'm not I'm just not getting the opportunity. I guess maybe that's me I need to like look harder, I guess, but like you would think someone who's been doing something for 10 years professionally and has a master's degree would be someone that you would want to hire. There's just not it's not even there's just nothing out there. There's no one no one's fucking hiring for that shit. So, I don't know. It's, I, it, I, that's why I wanna, that's another reason why I wanna switch over to like animation and graphic design is because like, no one needs a fucking video editor. No one cares. <laughs> no one's doing that shit anymore. People always need email templates to be made and uh, logos designed. And so I'm really, I'm like, I'm just like, it's a, uh, this has turned into a tough year <laughs> right at the beginning. It's, uh, you know how it goes. I'm down. I'm not out. You know what I mean? I'm not fucking defeated. I'm just, like, bummed because 
I just was hoping it would get easier, but I don't know why I thought it would. I don't... You know what I mean? At no point has anyone ever said, Oh yeah, it gets easier, don't worry. At least, luckily, it's not like... I, I didn't get fired, right? I didn't getting laid off. And I, I think that's like an important distinction. And like, it is at the end of the month. So it's not like I'm just like all of a sudden out of a job and money. I get to just... I just have to like accelerate my work search. It could be worse. It, things are Things are fine. <coughs> In other news, I, um, I'm almost super gold in Street Fighter. That's pretty cool, huh? I, uh, have been practicing with Metro. Getting into it, right? Like, I'm excited for... I'm excited to play the game now, and I feel like I'm improving, which is, you know... I, I feel like I talked about that before, where it was like, you know... Uh, if you don't get, if you don't feel improvement, like, what are you doing, right? It just feels like you're wasting time, so... Um... Luckily, that is happening. I think. I mean, it is. I'm, I'm, I'm ranking up. It's not quick, right? But I think it'll get quicker once I, when you learn what you're supposed to be doing, right, and you refine it, then you. That's when you like. Oh, okay, it all clicks, right? Like, there's gonna be a moment where it's like, okay, and like, I'm, it'll still be a grind for sure. Like, I'm definitely not expecting to just wake up and be like, oh, I'm grandmaster now, right? But like. You know, at some point, I'm going to understand what I'm doing better than most players. And I'm just going to, like, carry up. You know what I mean? I feel like that happens a lot, too, right? Like, there's a reason why you don't see a lot of platinum players. Because, like, once you get there, you just ca you just play and then you rank up, right? Because you, you kind of ex understand what you're supposed to be doing at that point. Then it's just, like, learning the matchup, so... Maybe, I don't know, I could be way fucking wrong on that, and I could get hard stuck at Platinum forever. And if that happens, I'll be sad, but... I'm actually, like, not, um, so concerned with... I'm, like, I'm excited to, like, look forward to, like, new fighting games. You know what I mean? Because, like, I feel like I'm starting to learn what to be... Like, what, how to play the fucking game properly. Once I... I feel like when once you get to, like, Platinum or... I feel like once you get to, like, Diamond, it's like, okay, you can start going and play other games. Because, like, you now understand what it is to play... A fighting game maybe i don't know that could just be like a totally self-imposed like maybe i'm god tier at dragon ball fighters or whatever but i like street fighter a lot but it is at the end of its life cycle and i hopped in like pretty late into it i've been playing for a year now so you know i'm not i don't know i guess it's i, I guess that's a is that a long time i actually don't know if that's like a how long a year is comparatively like i know like i know like four years is like this is when you should be, like, good at the game, right? Like, if you play something for, like, four years, like, you should be good at it. As as of now, you know, I, I feel I'm at, like, a good spot, right? Like, if it takes, like, four years to get to, like, Grandmaster, maybe three to get to Diamond, two to get to Platinum... Maybe I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe it's maybe it's fucking inverse, right? I mean, it also is just like you just have to play more. Like once you get to like once you get to like platinum, right? Like it's just winning. You just have to get your win percentage up. That's the thing. So I think it is just I just need to play like a lot more if I really want to start doing that. But I need to play like I'm trying to like shift my focus away from like grinding matches because this is the other part. I'm not at the point where I need to grind matches. I'm at the point where I need to practice matchups and like learn what I'm doing as always it's a process but it's been going well I think so and it's fun I'm having fun with it which is important my mindset's changed a lot I'm not getting as mad <laughs> I'm not getting as mad I still am getting like really frustrated at some matchups but that's you know I'll get better at that too I think I mean I feel like I'm now in the point where it's like oh yeah you gotta actually like take some time here my man it's good you're you're i'm still like i was like oh hell yeah i'm in the 80s now almost done with winter tot and it's like no <laughs> you're you're here forever don't forget you're here forever i'm doing solos to get better rewards so hopefully i hopefully i will get better rewards i guess it'll take longer it'll take longer but it'll also be like It'll, it'll, I don't know. It'll probably end up being about the same. It might take, like, a little bit longer, right? But I'm not in, like, a fucking rush to do it. I'm not, like, rushing it. Because I don't actually care. I mean, I got six months, baby. Man, my fiancé roasted a whole...
capon, which is a like a male chicken, I guess. Not like a rooster, I don't think, but like a, maybe it's like a juvenile chicken. I actually don't know, but um, it was this bird that we were gonna have for Thanksgiving, but ended up uh, having it. We ended up finding pheasants. We wanted we wanted pheasants, and we ended up getting this as like a backup. So it's just been in our freezer, but we finally, I got her this like it's a Magnolite roasting pot, which is like this old school um, like pot that's supposedly like really good for roasting birds and stuff like that. We roasted a, a bird, brought like, we like seasoned it and let it sit overnight and stuff like that in the fridge. And yeah, it, it fucking, it smacked. It came out so good. All right, did I get Groot? Important times here. No Groot on one. Uh, you want coins? How about you suck my wiener? You furry bastard. No, why am I running up here? Come on. Oh, I'm so bad at this game. Oh yeah, the turkey. Uh, so this, this roast chicken was in. Don't check the health just yet. I wasn't ready for that. The chicken came out so good. Yo, 45 fletching. Um... It was just like the skin was like crackly. It was like it was like uh, Thanksgiving dinner part two. It was awesome, but um, we um, made chicken salad with it. I mean, my fiance made other stuff with it too, like a, like a, like roasted potatoes and stuff in the in the roaster and all that. It was it was awesome. Great meal, great meal. But uh, we made chicken salad the next day, which was like the next highlight. And that shit, fucking, it was, I'm gonna have some for lunch today, actually. I'm gonna, I, I'm gonna run today and uh, see if I get Groot here. Nope. But, yeah. Um, yeah, it was, it was, it was real, real good. Very excited for, for the possibility of getting more uh, chicken, like that. <laughs> More roasted birds, please. Thank you. Anyway. Ah! All right, moment, y'all. Zen. We uh, done did it again. I wish there was like a nice spot to like. There we go. I'll stand here. Fuck. Come on, Zalfos. There we go. We uh, another day, uh, another farm run, and uh, we we continue on our journey. We made a friend along the way, which was cool. That guy was nice. I hope he, I hope he gets screwed. Um, I mean, if they want Groot, I don't actually know, but. Uh, yeah, we did it in record time. I don't actually know if it was record time, but, uh, we are sitting at 35,533,433 farm XP. Um, and no Groot. But, uh, maybe next time. Thanks for watching, everyone. Like, comment, subscribe. If you liked it, share the video, I guess. You don't actually have to share. Whoa, what the fuck? Who the fuck? What the? Whoa! Who is this? Is that Nex? That's crazy. That's wild. Um, yeah. Th uh, I, I should probably do this at the beginning. I'm gonna. I am gonna put this at the beginning. Hey, intermission here, guys. Like the video. Comment if you can. 
and subscribe if you really liked it. I appreciate it. Uh, those things mean a lot. I know we're, you know, we're a few subscribers, but we are mighty. So appreciate it. Keep enjoying the video.